I have my shirt on, just to let you know. But it's not about what I got on. It's about the DIY project. So, I know the lighting is back. So, DIY, flower wall. Let's get into it. I'm here doing a DIY project for my flower wall and this is day one um, I'm using my mirror frame my mirror previously broke and I wanted to use the frame because I was still obsessed with the gray frame that it displayed in my room and I will get another mirror soon hopefully so here I am just hot gluing the box that I got from Amazon on the back of the frame well the mirror frame and I ordered um, poster board but unfortunately I did not read that it said inches instead of feet so I'm just gonna speed up this video for you guys cuz you guys it looks like I'm moving really really slow the hot glue gun is just was not working for me it just was not sticking good enough with the boxes but yeah, I'm just going to speed up the video because that's all I'm doing. I'm just going to use a box. And I think, you guys, this is an easy way of doing it. You balling on a budget. So, yeah. That's all I'm doing for the back um, round the wall. What do you call it? Like the batting of, like, the, the flower wall. So, you won't be able to see the boxes. So, yeah. So here, Damn it. Yes. I, agree with you. I can never do these voiceovers. Okay, so basically um, right now I am just trying to figure out how I want the white flower to be on the board. So um, a tip that I am going to do is I'm just placing the first row right next to each other. So as you know, you can see it a little bit. Um, I'm going to zoom in. Um, for you guys and here I'm just trying to figure out how I want to do it so I'm just gonna count them out first like how many I'm gonna put over there but in, here's a little tip instead of put them putting the second row right next to each other put them in between each flower um, to give it more of a dimension you know I got that from my homegirl um, yeah so I think that'll give it a better pop on the frame so now I'm adding the pink in it, so I'm trying to figure out how I want to display it. But you guys can display it however you like your flower wall to be. There's no rules, but here's what I'm doing. So, you know, I'm pulling each stem out of the flower. And I'm going to use hot glue gun. I'm going to use a hot glue gun instead of, like, poking the stem through the back of the frame because I'm, I may want to move the frame here or there in my room. I'm not sure exactly where I would place it, but you know, guys, just keep on keeping on. <laughs> Make sure you have a good show to watch because this will take a while. Um, Moesha is on Netflix, you guys. So, yes, let's, you know, have some movies or some shows playing, some music playing because this will take some time. So of course this is mom life. Your kid always thinks you're the road. So let's just keep on keeping on and continue with this DIY project. Hey 
Hey guys, and since you made it this far in the video, do not forget to hit that subscribe button. Hey of course, Mason wants to help as always, as usual, my great big helper. Um, yeah, so I kind of just wanted to do it by myself, but I can't help it. I got to let him help me because he wasn't going to stop asking. So, yeah. If you have a helper, it's always good to have a helper. But the helper got to know what they're doing. <laughs> So this is the display I got so far. I'm just going to show you guys. So I got the three um, colors, flowers in between the white flowers. And yeah, sorry about the camera. I was just, you know, just trying to show you guys what I have so far. And yeah, so this is day one and I had to I order more from... flowers. So I ordered from Ling's Movement on Amazon. So I'll leave how much I ordered the first day, the second and the third day in the description box below. I'm just showing you guys um, what the packaging look like. It's really nice. It comes with a card and a coupon code if you want to keep ordering. And yeah. Let's see. Okay. It's a little strange. But I got the little greenery in this area. You know. And I'm going to work on this little area. Because I didn't like how up there had three. And right there already had three. And it was like two orange. It was like a pink, I mean, a coil, like a lighter pink. And I'll just call this like a coil color. So um, I'm just gonna add some white right here for you guys. But I'm going to glue now, it on. But I had to like burn this with a candlestick and glue it. I don't even know if y'all seen that. But I think I talked about it, or I will talk about it in the video. So, so I'm recording on my camera now. And I'm just trying to make sure I'm set up so you guys can see the little area that I'm going to just do for you guys. Even though you guys, like, it's like redundant. But, like, this is what I was just saying. Like, I literally had to burn... Like, just in case, if anybody get oversized, but please be, do this with a parent if you're too young. Um, if you get oversized, but look, you're, you're glue. So I never even said what it was, but my glue stick could not fit into the glue gun. Because of the wax from the candle. So I'm just placing it. I did a display first on how, like, I wanted more white flowers than red flowers because at first I was just going to make it all white. But I'll leave a link on where I purchased each of the items from off Amazon. This video is not sponsored, but someday I will be. You know, you got to speak it into the system. And wherever, like, I see, like, a hole, I'm probably going to add some green I didn't even attach the microphone to the camera so I'm, I need to do a test to see what sounds better Let's see just push that green in I could rip up the leaf off where I don't need it to be, but I'm just gonna I'm just gonna push it in. Cause I don't want to be too much green. So I think this is like 50 in one box, and then 50 in the other. So as you've seen in the previous video, um, I don't know if you know. I, I will explain it. I will try. Maybe I won't since I'm explaining it now. I just basically rip the tail off and then 
you know, glue from there. And it was better for it to lay flat, but some may think it's better to lay this way. I like how it comes out, like protrude, because it looks more flatter on camera. Like it looks just like it's just like tucked in. Like I feel like I need some more green for it to like explode onto the, especially this side, explode onto the um onto the, the frame. Like I need to add some more to these, and but I don't want to cover up the flowers. So anyway, guys. I'm glad you guys clicked this video. Don't forget, okay, to hit that subscribe button. I feel like a lot of people come here and don't subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe to your girl because, you know, that's what I need. I need you guys here so I can get a, a bag, okay? We can all get a bag, okay? Let's not forget. We can all get it back together. Copy, go see what you bargain for. Because you hype. You done got it. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for tuning in. And I'm going to have clips of it when I am finished. Okay. So this is the final look of the flower wall. It is about six feet tall. And I don't know how wide it is, but it's... It's six feet. And the, the, I meant to tell you guys, the, the flowers are like foam. So it's really pretty. I like how I made it, you know, make it dimensional. So yeah, this is the final look. Yeah. Do y'all see that net? Like, cause it's really about to make me Probably looking at me like I'm crazy. <laughs>